you can't do everything as far as health care via, via the telehealth platform, but the range that you can do, uh, we learned, is, is so important. And it's everything from primary care to outpatient urgent care to counseling and nutrition services and uh, behavioral health treatments, but also on the inpatient side, being able to provide critical care services, stroke care services that otherwise would not have been able to be provided before. So it's the full range. It's pretty amazing what we can accomplish uh, across the life continuum and for people no matter where they live in South Carolina. It's just we have to have all those key pieces in place in order for us to both sustain and spread that work. When you think about transforming healthcare, keep in mind pre-pandemic, we had some significant issues in the healthcare system in the US. The first being access to care, inconsistent access. And so many folks in many communities across the country would have to wait 30, 40, 60 days to see a primary care physician. So the issue of access was really important. The second is that there was inconsistent distribution of evidence-based guidelines. So the fact that you lived in a certain community meant that you were more likely to have this type of care versus another community. And so neither of those made sense. And what has really happened with telehealth is that instead of your geography defining your healthcare destiny, it really serves to level the playing field so that all Americans should get access to care and all Americans should get access to great care. An example of that that's really been very top of mind for many Americans is in the issue of behavioral health services. So pre-pandemic, one out of five Americans had a mental health issue and over 50% of counties in the U.S., I think it's closer to 75% of counties in the U.S., had no mental health services available. And what telehealth has done has really transformed the delivery of mental health services so that people are much more likely to have access to these services. From the clinician's perspective, they have greater visibility into their patients, their homes, and it has really provided a uh, much easier way to access those services and people show up for their appointments. So the no-show rate has dropped as well. So it's a great example of how telehealth has transformed healthcare.